The Sound Lab. 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 Experimenting with the best new music. Kane Hill. Yes, sir. How are you? Living life. Yeah, good. good. Yeah. Been good. awake for way too long. <laughs> yeah. That's how these things happen. The usual festival season life. <laughs> uh, you're here at Download. How's, uh, how's your day been so far? Uh, Pretty good. It was stressful at first. Our van got stuck in the mud, uh, like... Uh, just like a few meters away from the fucking yeah, stage. We're like 400 so. meters away from the stage. We've got 40 minutes to get our shit on it. Yeah. And we're like, we can't move. Like, oh, we'll get a tractor in five minutes. <laughs> 20, 20 minutes, minutes goes by. What the fuck? Uh, so, so, yeah. But so it went well. We, just we got everything on stage. Started exactly on time. Good. Uh, all credit goes to our tour manager, Tony Bacola, a fucking king in his own right. Don't tell him I said that. You'll never watch this. <laughs> I like to boast him up in places you'll never see. Yeah, absolutely. And then just into his face. Yeah, exactly. That's it. <laughs> Big ass bag of milk, dude. Yeah. Are, are you sticking around today anyway? Are you oh, hoping to catch yeah. some bands? Oh, yeah. We're watching yeah. Tool for oh, sure. I'm going to watch the fuck out of Tool. Yeah. Uh, we're going to go watch our friends in Crystal Lake, Cold Rain, and Palais Royale. Yep. Um, it's pretty much all. I, yeah. Is Hailstorm today? Yeah. They're, they're, no. Well, they are here. I just they're, saw them. They're here. They're around, but no. Well, fuck that me. was yesterday. Well, sorry. Yeah, tool. Uh, cool. So once you've finished here this weekend, what's the plan next for you guys? Uh, we've got a shit ton of shows and festivals in mainland Europe. Good. Um, with a bunch of different bands like Trivium, Amity Affliction, and Crystal Lake. Yeah. All just whenever. Um, and then we go home for the longest break we've ever had, four whole months. Uh, Excellent. To do a new record, write it, track it, ship it. Yeah. Uh, Good. And uh, how? Have we started work on it yet? Of ideas yeah, flying we've got, around? And we've got some. We've got some. Um, yeah. It's not done, but it, so far it's very fucking weird. Uh, Good. Yes. I, I'd like that. As you can tell by this yes. and, and this. You're looking great. <laughs> Thank you. Um, uh, yeah. So, your music, if I remember rightly, so I'm, I'm sure I do, started off quite heavy. Yes. Yeah. It's now kind of started to get a little bit more melodic and, and rockier yeah for sure is is that how it's going to continue it, it varies or are we going know. you know it goes it goes song to song it re, it's really hard to tell it, it's always it always comes from where we're at in life or you know where we're at in that time period yeah. you know like I remember like when we wrote the album Too Far Gone like I me particularly I was going through a depression spell you know and I had a lot of like that's why there's songs like why and erased yeah. they, they just they flowed out so naturally that melodicness but now me personally i'm over all that you know and i'm more like just happy and like you know just ready to do you know whatever so my mindset's definitely in a different place than it was when we did that album yeah. and it's the same thing for kill the sun kill the sun was very much like okay we we uh defeated this depression but here's me with a clear head talking about it yeah. you know and now to say what comes next i can't say what that's going to be a fucking clue. but it will be <laughs> so far it's weird good we, well like i said we, we do like weird so this let's, is how, let's we see how it goes yeah. excellent and once you've had your your four month break uh, I, I guess you'll be hitting the road again. Yeah. Where can we be seeing you in in the future? Likely here. Yeah. Good. We are in the UK at least once a year, usually yep. twice. So we won't be gone for long. Yeah. I, we prefer it here. They've, they've been yeah. talking about us doing like a mini headliner sort of deal. So yeah. Well, that I, I'm may or may not happen. Yeah. Pretty fucking bad. Yeah. Because we've never done a headliner over here except when we played Download the first time, and it was. Garbage. Yeah. Uh, we had like what three songs out at that point. Uh, yeah, barely. Yeah, it was not good. It was not good. So that's what I want to do next year. I want to headline over here. That way I think it's plan. definitely time. Oh yeah. You definitely have the material. So sure. we can do. We, uh, when we did our headliner at home, we had like a two-hour set every night, um, and that's fun. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah. So. Uh, Cool. I, I hope that happens, and I'm sure your fans hope that happens. I'm as well. sure they do. I'm sure they're pissed about seeing us play 30 minutes every time. Yeah. Why they keep spending money on us? I don't know. Yeah, they're Thank just you. Just to see you, Thank and then you. they walk off. Yeah. That's it. They're already there to see you. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. That's happened to me before. I've uh, I've seen a band that's been sold the tickets because of the support. They've left, and there's only been about 10 people left in the room for the headliner. It happens, unfortunately. Yeah. So, 
not great. Say la vie. Say la vie. Be a better headliner. I don't know. There you go. And yeah, so touring. Is there anywhere that you haven't been before that we you want do to go want to, to go? Japan. Yeah. Japan. So bad. We've been to pretty much. We haven't done South America. I'd love to do like. Like, I want to do Central and South America yeah. because we've heard Brazil, obviously, is fucking amazing. Please come to Brazil. Uh, Mexico, everything that we've heard about them is that they're just the most appreciative crowds in the world. But Japan, we just want to see Japan. Yeah. And it feels like metal is mainstream over there, so it feels silly to not go yeah, to Japan. Yeah, absolutely. Take advantage of that. Uh, but I don't want to go to Russia. Do not want to do, go to Russia. Do you not think you'll fit in, or do you think they won't like you, or, or do you know, not Russia like Russia scares me. You can just they all, think that, it scares everyone. You can yeah. walk into the venue with a TMP, and they're like, whatever. <laughs> you know? Like, uh, our management told us that um, they have a lot of bigger bands than us, obviously, yeah. and whenever they play there, there's actually a ransom budget of up to $200,000, yeah, or 200000 Russian, wow. but it's fuck it's a that. Lot to think about, but we've also had homies be like, "Y'all are tripping. Y'all need to go there." Yeah. You know, so so we probably will. Yeah. <laughs> I don't mean any <laughs> offense by I this to any of the Russians. We're just scared. We're from Louisiana. Yeah. We don't know what it's like there, yeah. but sure. the show is always look fucking huge. Yeah. So it's either uh, I'll go wherever they tell me to go. In, in all honesty. Yeah. Good. Well, it's been a pleasure. Absolutely. Having a catch up with you guys. Thank you very much. Thanks very much. The sound lab. 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 Experimenting with the best new music.